Happy Tuesday, everybody. I'm very excited because something arrived in the mail today. It's been like a non-stop past few days of cool things arriving in the mail, um, but this one I'm incredibly excited about. I'll give you a hint. It starts with a boy and a yellow backpack. Guess what it is? Perhaps you can guess from the stuff behind me. That's right, I just received an amazing package from my friends at Fangamer. For those of you who know me, huge fan of Earthbound. It means the world to me. I have it tattooed on my arm. The Chosen Four inspire me and drive me in every aspect of my being. And a awesome collection of new swag just arrived in the mail. And I have to show you everything that's in it. It's super cool. So the first item that was in the package is a yellow backpack, which is reminiscent of the one worn by Ness, uh, who is the title character in the series. You have a mother badge insignia on the bag, and it looks pretty darn similar to what he wears. This is perfect for if you're a cosplayer, uh, cosplaying Ness, which is what I did for years at Anime Expo, but this is a high quality, perfect yellow backpack, suitable for any Ness. This is great. Inside the backpack were a lot of different swag items that I'm going to show you right now. I'm going to rapid fire them because there are so many cool little neat items in this thing and you got to see them all. So rapid fire, go! Jackie's Cafe and Foresight bottle opener. Thank you for visiting Magnet Hill. A magnet! Congratulations, you're officially the third strongest character in the cave. Don't forget to return your map. Need to get around? Consider driving in a mad taxi. Mad Taxi Cab Co. Foresight Eagle. Come play some slots at the Presidential Luxury Hotel and Slots in Dusty Dunes Desert. Just look out for the traffic. There seems to be a lot of it. Now your dad is going to send you a lot of money from his burger shop, so you're going to need to take the ATM card. Be sure to do that. If your name is Jeff, these are your most important items. You gotta size up the situation, you know? Oh geez, tax season. Well, I wonder if I can write off this stuff. I don't know about the burger and fries, but I can sure write off the crack bat and t-ball bat. Don't forget your ticket for the bus. Just remember to write home, or at least call home once in a while. Your mom would love to hear from you. Look, if you're going to want to meet the Runaway Five, you have to get this all-access backstage pass. Which I have. And it's okay, I can bring one person in with me from the crowd. Also now with custom Runaway Five lanyard. I also got a few merit badges for a giant step. Milky Well, and Lumine Hall. Oh, and what's this? A present? What is this? Wait a second. Holy crap, a soundstone? Are you kidding me? You might be wondering by now, what is the reason for all of these items? And it all ties in with Fangamer's release of the Earthbound Handbook. The entire team has worked on for months and months and months to create a new player's guide for Earthbound. Now I have this sweet little, has a book cover on it, uh, but I'm going to show you some of what this looks like. First of all, it came in this sweet display case. You are now Earthbound. Alongside the PK Psychonetic Earthbound fanzine, which has a lot of fan art and writing and everything into it, as well as an album produced by the community. The Earthbound Handbook, which was designed by all the folks over at the Fangamer office, is the Travel Eagle Land, the Earthbound Way. And holy crap, is this? It's an odor reality card to each Earthbound site you visit. When you see an odor reality marker on the guide, just scratch and sniff the right numbers to reveal a smell right out of the game. This is a scratch and sniff card that will tie in with all aspects of what you encounter in the game. For those of you who had the player's guide for the original copy of Earthbound, they had scratch and sniff stickers in the manual. This is a great throwback to that. and It's just beautiful. It breaks down every area of Earthbound with original art, strategies, how to take on the bosses. This is just a pure work of art and something that as an Earthbound fan I am so happy to add to my collection. Amazing work by the Fangamer team and this is something that you definitely want to get a hold of if you're an Earthbound fan. For those of you who have never played Earthbound before, it's about four friends that come together on a journey to take on an alien force that is changing the behavior of people around the world. And it's an incredible story, has huge heart, has tons of funny moments, and it's 
easily one of the best games ever made. I believe it is the best game ever made. Go check it out. It's available on Wii U, Nintendo 3DS, uh, and of course for Super Nintendo if you want an original copy. Now original copies will run pretty expensive because of the collector community and what they're building it to. Heck, the box that I have on display cost me several hundred dollars just for the box, um, but the game is well worth it and I highly recommend giving it a shot when you can. Thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that like and consider subscribing. I'm going to keep doing these vlogs on my channel as well as unboxings and all sorts of stuff throughout the year as well as my live broadcast. So lots of things. I know that sounds like a huge salesman pitch, but I would love to see you here on the channel. In the meantime, say fuzzy pickles.